it's Toby Travener here. I'm just on stage at another conference at the moment. And I thought I'd take this opportunity to say good day and say I'm really looking forward to being the MC at the AFA conference coming up very soon. I tell you what, I rely on my financial advisor to give me advice to stay really up to date with what's going on but most importantly to stop me from making really stupid mistakes. And one of the things that that means is that every financial advisor needs to be up to date with all the things that allow you to be able to advise your clients in the best possible way. And that's what this conference is all about. And to give you more about what, I suppose, the pearls of wisdom that you're gonna be able to get from this conference, I'm gonna hand you over right now to Nick Hakes, who's gonna tell you all about it. We'll see you then. Thanks, Toby. You set that up brilliantly. And Toby's right, the AFA National Advisor Conference is a convergence of ideas and knowledge and learning at the very leading edge of financial advice. Our profession is world class and it's something that we should all be proud of. Importantly, the programming for the AFA Advisor Conference is all practitioner led, which means you can share in the strategies which the world's best advisors are using in their practice. All of our focus sessions balance the theory and the practice, so these are critical issues and opportunities as shaped and determined by advisors, and then the culture of the AFA, collaboration and peer-to-peer -peer learning is how advisors are solving those challenges and grabbing their opportunities. Go to the AFA conference website to see all of the focus sessions. And let's not forget the plenary headline acts. Zelda Lagrange, the former presidential aide to Mr. Nelson Mandela. Dr. Jason Mitchell, professor of psychology at Harvard University. Chris Riddell, a digital futurist. Jeremiah Demaray from the US, a digital marketing specialist. Uh, Amy Florin from the US, an expert in working with financial advisors there in helping their clients deal with the emotional transitions of life. And lastly, Sir Bob Geldof. What our profession does is for a higher social purpose and there is no doubt that Sir Bob and his humanitarian work over many decades links to the good work that financial advisors do for your higher social purpose. So not too late to register, see you on the Gold Coast at the AFA National Advisor Conference. Cheers.